Hello Nintendo Chit Chatters and welcome back to more Monster Hunter stories on the Nintendo 3DS. Shoutouts to Nintendo for providing me a copy of the game and this is episode 11 guys. Last episode we went on a little bit of an exploration event into a monster den, uh, fighting a few new monsters, getting some really cool rewards. Then we also went into uh, the forest area. We found Lilia. Uh, we had a really cool uh, new monster to attack there as well which we saved kind of Lilia from the attack. It was pretty awesome. When we came back to the village here, Lilia went off with Captain Simone. I think Cheval is walking back with a monster egg on his own. And this is just a few days later. Here we are at the scene right now. It says, so Lilia and Cheval have both gone their own ways, huh? The villagers seem quiet without those two around, you know. Let's check up on how things are going around Hockham Village. All right, so we're back to Hockham Village here. We also have the Monsterpedia from last episode. So uh, in this episode, guys, episode 11, let's go back and let's actually check a look, take a look at our Monsterpedia. So we can kind of learn more about the monsters. So wild monsters and monsties. These are the ones we find in, um, I guess, in our exploration. Cool, we actually get a little bonus here when you open it up and read it. So this is the Aptanoth. It's hatchable too. We've already hatched one. We have um, Reese or Rusty. I think it's Reese is his name. All right. So the Velociraptor, of course. Got a carcass for this. We've seen plenty of those and battled a bunch of them. These Neopters, um, they kind of like roll into a very hardened armor shell. Got some whetstones. Cool. These are actually, these Kelbys can actually attack, apparently. I didn't know you could. They're like a little kind of deer with horns. These guys here, these Hermitors, they're a little bit tough. And the Bullfango, they're pretty strong too. We saw one of those. Actually, we saw a couple of them. We only battled one, though. We got Shroom and Larva from that. Awesome. What else here? Unknown. The rarity of that's unknown. We got a um a flash bomb from that. Okay. This guy here is cool. The Arzuros. Blue and yellow. When you see blue and yellow, you could be a dead fellow. And this guy here was attacking Lilia. Vitality nutrient. Awesome. Okay, it's a pretty big monsterpedia. We've seen a couple of them here. The Ladrome, we saw him as well in that area. I think he was in the monster gen, wasn't he? One of them were. Here's an Arkakuga. Yikes. Strength nutrient. All right, and there we go, guys. And Monsies, we'll check out these really quick. Alright, cool, got Herb for that, Aptanoth, and of course, the Velocidrome. Some raw meat for that one too. You can see the rarity there, and also the HP, attack, defense, and speed. They're pretty fast. Alright, let's see what our battle pouch has. Vital Essence. Medicine bring with Indomitable Spirit. Restores one heart. Uh, Aloe Leaves here has a chance of curing burn for one party member. That's pretty cool. Paralysis Knife. Knife that deals 15 damage and causes paralysis for three turns. Wow. I'll take that. And I'll take the Smoke Bomb in the pouch. That'll be good. We'll save that. Alright. Alright, what do we have to do here? These are all cleared right now, so... Let's go talk to some people, I guess, right? Yeah. 
I wonder if I should talk to Chief Amna. Is there just something on the map? Let's go follow the map up this way. Hi, Chief. I'll surpass bypass Chief here. Go all the way up here. Protective Rider. Pretty cool. Is this is Dan. Yep, there's Dan. How are you, Eddie? You don't look particularly particularly awesome. You know, I'm worried about Cheval too. Just leaving the village like that. But there's no use moping around forever. You've got to work to do. You'll never be a great rider if you just laze about. I know. Why don't you try your skills out against me? It'll help you gain some experience of battling other riders. Ready, kiddo? Okay, so we're going to test battling him. Awesome! No holding back, you hear? Now come at me, kiddo. This will be interesting. Cool. A little bit of a learning experience here for us. So he's at the mouth of him. Pull your guard down. Now it's my duty to inform you that rider battles have special rules. So this is teaching you, you can do some online rider battles, I believe. All right, I mean, check out those hearts. So it's a bit different. If you or your monsters get knocked out, you'll lose a heart. And the first side to fall to zero hearts loses outright. So those, that one item we saw restores one heart. So that'd be great for rider battles, apparently. Okay, so first select fight. Now this is important. Listen up. You can attack opponent's monsters, but you cannot attack the rider directly. Ah, oh, so it's pretty much Monsty versus Monsty. You can also use items. Switch Monsties. In fact, there's loads you can do. Got it? Awesome. Let's try it out. Okay. Uh, he's going to be slow. Fight. Um... Speed attack here. Depending on the situation, your opponent may switch monsters. Can ship up. Head to head. I could use some items here. Or use items. You won't win just by just, by just attacking, that's for sure. She's a paralysis knife. Head to head. Swift strike? Awesome. Can chip up. That's a point for us. They've gotten back up. They're using swift strike. Power Clash. We gotta use an item here for Charlie. I could switch monsters too, right? Yeah, I could. Ooh! That's real guts. Let's ride. Point to us. Victory. I'm the best. All right. Not bad. Pretty fun. Awesome. You're really improving. You can now use local play and online play. Now you can polish your skills against other riders wherever you are. Cool. So I guess we come here to do the online and local battles. Select network battle from the menu to battle against other players. Oh cool, from the menu, okay. Network battles can be played with nearby local play or far away players online play. You can really feel yourself improving, right? I think it's time for another test. There's a monster called the Veteran that's been making a nuisance of itself. Apparently it's holed up near the old mine. The villagers in the area are too scared to get so close for fear of being attacked. Now, your job will be to investigate this rogue, Yen Kutku. Alright, you have passed Dan's first test. Today's training is slightly different. You'll be investigating the Yen 
Kutku, uh, head to the old mine in the rocky section, Bonjour Hills. Make sure to equip this before you head out. Cool, obtain fire. Potions, too. Alright, guys, so let's go to our menu here. Equipment. Nothing new here. Ooh, we have this, though. Alright, so we're equipped. This equipped. Alright. So this slightly reduces fire damage taken from enemies. Alright, we have that on already, and then a weapon. We have that. Okay. And battle pouch. No more flash bombs, so... Let's swap out... Vital Essence restores one heart. What can I put? I put the Vital Essence in there or oh, Aloe Leaves. Has a chance of curing burns. So we'll put we'll put those in there. We're out of the bombs there, so. All right, that's good. All right, and also from the menu here. Rider car, rider's notes. Subquests. So we don't know subquests. We can, I guess, speak to other people um, to do more like side quests if we wanted to. All right. So here's this next mission. So the old mine we have to go to. Did you equip that Talesman that I gave you? Yeah, pretty sure we did. We'll check. It's equipped. Okay. Just looking around there. Pretty awesome. So we have a local online play unlocked as well, which is really cool. Not sure how far we get in this episode. Um, I think we'll head out here and see how far we can get. Wish us luck, Dan. We're on our way. So apparently this monster is probably a fire breather or something. That's what I'm thinking. So let's do this. Let's go out here. Exploring. This bridge always scares me. Look, it gives out. Follow this path. So we're going to the left a little bit up here. Hi guys, good to see you. Talking to the monsters that the Aptonauts. Whoa, mill meat. Per meow meow meow. I can hear something weird coming from the back of the old mine. It's like there's a mystery that needs to be solving. Go check it out. Bypass this guy here. I don't want to fight these guys at all. Huh? 
probably should get onto a path of some sort. Is there like an entrance to this mine? It's like a big old carcass or bones over here. Uh, monster bone, yeah. So, it's like a plateau. What is that noise? So we can go up here. Let me get over here really quick. Get this. Is it paint berries? That's indeed what they are. There's a little guy here. Hmm. What's happening? Right, what's going on with that stand over there? Meow, 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 meow. 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 Meow, 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 meow. What's that you're for or not? I am Cataban Driver. Today I was just driving along as normal when suddenly a Yan Kutku appeared, made me jump out of my fur. Then it, it broke my perfect Cataban with its big, ugly beak. I can't work in these conditions. I'm exhausted. Pull yourself together, kitty. My Cataban. I'm missing a wheel now. Oh, such perfection ruined. Ruined! That clawful Yankatu stole my wheel and ran off into the distance. And this Yankatu Kutku is so tough that it's been nicknamed the Veteran. It lives over there on the opposite shore of the lake. Paul, please be careful. Meow. You really need to pull yourself together. On the opposite shore of the lake? Let's make like a bread and roll, buddy. Opposite shore of the lake. All right. Story quests have been updated. A catavaner is in trouble at the old mine. So the sly bird is known as the veteran. Waits on the other side of the lake. Do whatever you can to fix the curse. The other side of the lake. Ooh, monster bones. It's all the way over there, huh? How do we get over there? Looks like we can use this trail here. <clears throat> Grab these while we're at it. What's that thing there? Do I want to fight that monster or try to avoid it? Ew, it's a big, na big nasty thing. Nothing with this guy? <laughs> Ooh, what's this? Somebody's already in that treasure? Hmm. That was one big nasty creature there. There's one there too. Ooh, honey. Mushrooms. Blues. These was for potions earlier. We should try making some new potions, actually. I got a bunch here. Um, I believe. 10 out of 10 potions right now. I think we got more at that last um, battle we had. Plus the four or five that we made. I used one of them. Or two of them. Something like that. Leave me alone. They're chasing me down here. Mount Pondre Caves. I'm avoiding some of these um, battles. Oh, geez. Is that him? Try to jump onto him. Look at this guy here. That monster up ahead must be the one they call the veteran. Regular Yen Kutku are pretty timid. This one struts around like it owns the place. 
It's not gonna let us walk away now. Stay on your paws, buddy. Wow. Time to fight. The veteran, Nayaha, bring it on! Let's show what we can do. So we actually have the battle a little bit on double speed. I'll put it on normal speed for now. X, you can do single or normal speed, double speed, and then also triple speed. Speed up the, speed up the battles if you want to. Excuse me. Kutku Tackle. Wow. Body part attacks damage the whole. Let's start taking out body parts. Okay. Cool stuff falls from body parts, and it can make the battle easier. Interesting. So the head. No, Monsty! Fireball! They're using Fireball! Oof. That's a mean power attack. Power Clash. Kinship up, alright. Technical. Darn it. I'm gonna ride. We can choose speed attack. Velocity crush. Here we go, kinship skill. Can't use that. Ah, oh. technical. Use some potion, or use an herb. Fireball again. Power Clash. Come on. Ken ships up. Oh. Fireball, man. Mm. 32. I should bring um, Reese in here. Speed versus speed. We did it! The veteran's defeated! There we go. Alright, good job. We need to bring Reese in more. You're forgetting to switch monsters. It's returning to its den. Victory! I'm the best! 
All right, Kutku webbing. Pink scale for my Yinkaku. Highly resistant to heat. Awesome. Flame sacks. Rank A. Cool. Good battle. Pretty epic. The Yinkaku ran away. That's what we call retreat in the rider business. But you can chase after it. Just head for the monster gen marked on the map. I'll bet my last stunt will find the Cataban wheel we're looking for there. Alright, so retreat. Sometimes when you defeat a monster, it will go back and return to its den. This is called a retreat. It's a great chance to get the monster's egg. Okay. So, we're going to do that. We're going to ride. And let's go. Let me get this um, carcass. Brute bones. Let's go chase after this guy. I'm curious if we get an egg. Maybe we can hatch it. What is happening over there? Are they fighting? Bunch of stuff here. Herbs. Adamant seeds are good. Here we go. Yen Kutku's den. There it is. That's the Yen we're after. Be careful. Injured monsters are like quartered rats. They can be vicious. The battle's not over. Here, guys. Time to fight. Swift strike, nice. Quick to tackle. Wow. I should have used power for there. Fireball. Oh no. Monsty. That's real guts. Yikes. Need some herbs. Recover. Head to head. Kinship up. Let's ride. Like the wind. Speed attack. Here we go. Kinship skill. About a little bit less than half health here. Whew. Double power attack. Nice. He's down. Now's our chance. Drop an item. Watch out. Power clash. Alright, let's toast. Alright guys, we did it. Let's get this egg. Some scales. Awesome. More flame sacks as well. Pretty good battle. Possum, we managed to take down the veteran. Feels good to be a fully fledged rider, huh? You know, I'm really feline fine. 
Hey, look, it's a catavan wheel. That catavan is going to be really spooked when we get this back to him. All right. Okay, let's head to the old mine and get this back to the rightful owner. But uh, it would be wheel waste to not grab a monster egg over here. That is true. Give it here. Doesn't smell of anything boring. It's also a light one. Come on, buddy, let's get a good one. Give it here. One more. They're all gone. Uh, never any luck. We gotta get out of here. <laughs> that egg's so heavy. Slowly. Let's do it. Let's leave. This big den. Alright. So the egg was nothing. No monster to hatch. Can we get up there? Yeah, we can get up here. Leave me alone. <laughs> Get some herbs really quick. Let me see. Some more honey and seeds. Wonderful. Another mushroom. What's this? More paint berries? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. It's more paint berries. Wool mill wheat. They're always good. Set plants. Okay. Heading back for this wheel. Here you go, buddy. Little kitty cat. <laughs> meow! Thank you, thank you, thank you. Now I can repair my catavan. Thanks for helping me out. If you wish to use a catavan, I'm at your purpose. Just jump on. I'll take you anywhere you want to go. Nayaha, he seems really spoke to have fixed the catavan, buddy. I know. I'll take you back to the village. Come on. Get a move on. Get ready to depart. That's sweet. On the way to fast travel, you can ride the catavan from any orange umbrella. It's a catavan stand. Sweet. That's really cool. Now's the perfect time to try it out. Okay. Use. Alright, so Felines the Catman Stand will transport you to other stands you found. It's a great way to travel long distances in a short time. So you can travel between stands that you've already activated. Search for more stands to make getting around a breeze. Cool. We're going to save here, guys. Alright, we will save here, 
at this catavan. It's pretty awesome. So if we search around and find more of these, we can travel from point to point. Make sure you guys drop a like for us, blast the like button, comment below your favorite part of the episode, and join us back here for next time with another episode of Monster Hunter Stories in 3DS. I'm Eddie Ray. See you guys next time.